Let me tell you something. I think the feds own the NBA young boy about the death of G Money, man. The day NBA Lil Pap was sentenced to five years in prison for accessory to second degree murder. G Money mom just spoke out about the sentences. She said nobody got charged with murder. He was charged with accessory to second degree murder. We never got a shooter, but the God I have in me, he don't sleep. And y'all remember G Money's sister just spoke out after Fred O'Bang and NBA Youngboy squashed their beef and did a toy drive together for the community in Baton Rouge. She say, I be so hurt for my brother dog. He really trusted these bitch ass niggas, and I don't like that. She mad about that toy drive. She big mad. She don't like that. See, y'all got to look at the history of what happened. NBA Youngboy and Jeep Money was close friends, man, just like FBG Duck and King Vaughn was cool. They represented TBG, but when Jeep Money put that mushroom tip in Youngboy's sister, man, that started a war, man. They were beefing on social media. They were dissing each other on records until Youngboy got locked up on that murder case, and Jeep Money just kept on dissing them while he was locked up serving time. Then Jeep Money went on the interview with Say Cheese this young boy real hard talking about how he had his sister in different positions talking about how he don't rock with this one and what he gonna do with that one man young boy took that shit real personal man but he fell back because his career started taking off when young boy got out of prison his career started blossoming he became bigger than the person that he was friends with G Money but G Money just would not let it rest G Money kept jugging that young boy he made this song after this song to a boom, he wound up dead after leaving the studio from recording another diss record about NBA Youngboy. Somebody knocked him off and shot him 18 times. I see, Fred O'Bain probably has some accountability in himself for G Money death because G Money was supposed to be in New York City out of town doing interview with Vlad and all kind of other people before he died. But he stayed in Baton Rouge to go help Fred O'Bain with what he got going on. And then he died, dog. So y'all gotta look at this the right way. I'm for NBA Youngboy and Fred O'Brien making up. I'm for all the stop the violence beef and all that stuff y'all be got going on. But we need to stop it at the head, man. Y'all killing each other over wordplay. Y'all killing each other over nothing, man. We can make so much money together, man. And the problem is NBA Youngboy don't do us no good in prison for murder. Yeah, NBA Lil Pap don't do us no justice in the federal judicial system for second degree murder accessory. That don't do us no justice. Fred O'Bain don't do us no justice in the federal prison system. Yeah, G Money don't do us no justice in the goddamn graveyard, man. We need them around. They got good music. They talented. Y'all got to stop the beef because the beef costs money, man. It's going to have you paying lawyer fees and it's going to have you paying them funeral fees. The lawyer winning and the funeral home look this shit because they got plenty of room for more trust what i'm saying baby y'all got to stop killing each other man i pray they get it together i pray nba young boy continue to blossom with his career i pray nba young boy continue to get it together man because i see he's starting to grow up and do the right thing i see them when they got married i see he done had another baby i see the maturity i see the growth i see him maturing as an artist i see him making better music i see him trying to pre-stop the violence i see him making his future bright by fixing his Pass. I see what he's doing, he's growing. But see, the statute of limitation of murder never ever go away, man. They could bring back a murder on you at any day, man. Trust what I'm saying, dog. And I get that G Money was jugging that NBA young boy, and I ain't trying to put it out there and say that he did something to old boy. But I'm going to say this to this if you keep jugging it, if you keep poking the bat, the bat going to growl, man. Yeah, it's only so long before you keep playing with somebody, folks. They show you everybody ain't playing. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel. YouTube.com slash Dino Brown 305. We the business.